Good morning guys, how you doing? Um, my name is Matt, uh, welcome to my channel. Um, hopefully my channel's going well. Um, yeah, if you see me do this, I, it's nervous. Um, okay, I've uh, been printing, been painting, uh, been selling, uh, not selling, and directions to go in the future, I don't know. Um, so, uh, I've got a new project. Um, I was doing uh, something, but it broke, and um, it's on to the next one. Um, so, I'll change the camera around and we'll have a look. Okay, so here we are. I've uh, got a uh, John Wick model I've printed. Um, the base is the second base they printed because. The lower, the supports were um, medium supports, which embedded itself into the um, the base into the the raft. Um, this one has a little bit of a an edge there where it was uh, it's not supported very well. So I'm going to have to look at my supports again. Um, but as this is the only one that I'll be doing, it's not a big deal. Okay, right, so that's that. <clears throat> and all the parts came out well. All they're all hollow. I've used uh, Sun Lu water washable resin on these. Um, just the legs, the jacket looks like that. It is a nice finish on these. It's like a hard plastic rather than a, a resin. I would like it to be more of a, a softer, pliable material. Which I can look, on, look at in the future. Um, but the details on this is pretty damn good. As I said, it's all hollow. Um, done some prepping on it. Um, I've used light supports and then medium supports just to give it a bit of anchorage to the, the build plate. Um, where I can position the pieces in a more upright position rather than leaning over. So there's no um, supports markings on the clothing on the legs though did get to a point where you have somewhere like that that needed uh, a support and it's left a little dimple there and up up on its leg which one is it? I think it's the back heel part that part there there was a support in there but it printed it well in a little bit of filler, a little bit of time, and it's going to be good to go. Um, shoes. Now, this has a nice feel to it. It's like um, you run your nail over and you can feel. You can hear the layer lines. Um, but a bit of primer and the layer lines will go. Uh, now, the layer lines, the layers I've used was 0 0.05 mil, which is a bit a standard height for the head, and the head came out amazing. Uh, for the head, I did in 0 0.03 mil for. Um, 1.9 seconds per layer height and yeah amazing detail on the Saturn 2 absolutely amazing um, just that head took six hours to print if I was if I was to do it in 
um, 0.5 mil, then it would take about three and a half hours to print. Now, time over quality is uh, a thing. Um, so, yeah, everything fits well. we're looking at is like that there you go. so yeah that's me that's the introduction to my next build um, any questions comments um, I'll be happy to answer anything and um, I'll see you on the next video. Cheers, guys.